YouTubers, this is EMDSD14R with another cool video today. The locomotive you see here is called the SD40PX-2. Now you're probably wondering what the PX-2 is. It's an experimental model that's based off of the SD40P uh, and SD40P-2s, but it's different as you can see by the radiator section it's very different it's a little bit, the, the hood is a little bit longer than your standard SD uh, P40 or SD40-2P um, lights, uh, the headlights are custom by me I don't know if you guys can see that clearly let me get my little poker thing or my little piece of copper piping these are the Mars lights those are the headlights and the number boards go in back here um, all this has been kit bashed you use your stock Atherin Blue Box SD40-2 and let me show you that you really don't need to do much of anything except you need to cut the shell bef uh, after the second to last door to remove this whole section here of course you need to retain that fan so you have to cut that off and sand it down so it's completely level and then you just splice your extra long piece on here and then that's about it you don't cut this out don't cut that out because uh, that will weaken your shell So. That's how I was made, able to make that unit. I had a spare piece laying around. I was going to make a high nose unit eventually, but then I just got the idea to to make this unit, and it came out great. You can actually see it from the rear here. See how the sections slightly bulge out. The sections I used, I used an Atherin Blue Box um, SD45 radiator screens. They, they, they're detachable. I split them in half. I took the straight part, used it as the top, used the angle part as the bottom, sanded it and filed it to make it look like it was two separate uh, radiator grills. Fan is a, a uh, aftermarket fan. This is the original fan. If you guys look, you can see how much lower the last two fans are compared to the first two. You could also think of this as another version. You could think of this as a version of the SD45 um, X models. They had um, four radiator fans in the rear also, so that's where I got, I got that idea from there also with the four radiator fans, the rear ones anyway. So there's a total of six of them. All I need to do now is I need to drill out the holes here for the model for the lights the top ones are already done I just need to drill out the holes for the bottoms and then that'll be it get a power chassis for it because this is a dummy I think a Sid I think that's his name Sid 79 I bought this from him about a year and a half ago and this was my only Burlington SD40-2 and I was kind of a little skeptical about doing it but then I just decided to go ahead and and go for it um, so yeah I decided to do that and this is what uh, the result is so it's a very unique model it's an experimental locomotive it's you know, there's, you know it's based off of some prototypes but there's really no prototype that's that, that might have similarities but this is completely different the rear bulge here is actually a Athen Blue Box Jeep 9 section but it kind of does look like a SD45 at the rear. It kind of does, but the flare is not as apparent. So, I just wanted to show you guys that. Great looking locomotive. It'll be painted into ERW colors very soon and powered with sound and DCC. So, you guys be cool and enjoy this one of a kind. Another uh, custom locomotive by yours truly. Alright? God bless. Happy New Year. Bye.